Welcome back to another daily unboxing video with yours truly, Sam Healy. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Mansions of Madness 2nd Edition Expansion Horrific Journeys. Uh, of course, it's coming from Fantasy Flights and uh, it's going to have a bunch of new stuff. It does require Mansions of Madness 2nd Edition to play and induces three new scenarios that take investigators far from Arkham, solve perilous mysteries aboard a bustling transatlantic airship, a luxury ocean liner, or a scenic countryside train. All right, interesting. Well, let's go ahead and take a look and we'll go from there. All righty, let's see here. And artwork is always really neat. Oh, they actually worked in everything. What did it say? It said a luxury ocean liner, a transatlantic airship, and a scenic countryside train. Okay, so here's the train. Here's the ocean liner, and there's the airship. So that's cool. They worked all three of those into the cover uh, to begin with. That's cool. All right. Hey, hey, a catalog. Um, Mansions of Madness, Expansion Overview. Artwork is good, of course. And then we have a whole bunch of stuff here that is shrink-wrapped. So let's get that open. All right. And of course we have these modular boards. Wow, that came out really easy. Uh, too easy. If, if this, however, is not. All right, well, it did come out. Viewing room three or the ship deck. That's cool, double-sided. And we have the Looks like monster tokens, a dimensional shambler, and the stuff you need on the other side of it. This monster can move through impassable borders and walls. Ooh, that sounds very bad. Yeah, these are coming out pretty good. This one is the viewing room one and ship deck one. Okay, well, cool. We're just not going to punch out the rest of these or just take a look at them, though. This looks like it's part of the train engine cabin. And this is the caboose over here. This is another viewing room. And the decks of the ships. So that's neat. I'm just trying to show you all of the artwork that's on here. So there's the freight car. This is the dining car. And in the dining room. That looks like a pool. Yep. All right. Oop, that popped out. Passenger car, sleeper car, and this is a passenger car too. That looks like the uh, pole people will be there. Cabin three, cabin four, bridge. Okay, I like these. I like these a lot. The tracks, observation car. On the other side, the lifeboat. All right, cool. And then here we had a freight car. That one popped out and I didn't realize it. And the storage hold on the other side. All right, very cool. So we've got some minis here. And these are rather interesting. Wow, that just looks like a blob of plastic. But um, we all know that it isn't. That is something freaky. All right, we got it. And it looks like we have um, some kind of trainer, maybe. Uh, this guy is the dude that's in the book. And we have a merman or something to that effect. A trumpeter. Um, she is, looks like she might be a waitress or something like that. She's got, I think, a s order book in one hand and a pen in the other. So we'll see. And that person has a gun. And these guys are the dimensional shamblers I think we saw earlier. Um, and then, oh, wait, wait, wait. We got it. We got it. Looks like something else. 
goes right in there like so that's not a very good fit mm. but that is the way it goes all right so yeah that's pretty nasty looking we got a couple of uh, those merman dudes a couple of shamblers some peeps back there all right so then we have the uh, actual you know places that these things will go into let's see what these cards have on them and after that we'll be pretty much done taking a look at this but let's go ahead and take a look so, uh, look at the back of this card but do not reveal it to the other investigators this is cursed x i bet you yeah so i don't want to spoil too much of this 41 derringer astronomy guidebook captain's hat coal shovel diver's helmet gate box harpoon catley gun life preserver map of ley lines <coughs> Mystic Sextant, Sturdy Luggage, Mists of Riley. Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that, but uh, okay. Um, these are all the same. Storm of Spirits, Plum of the Void, Lost in Time and Space, Insane. Okay. It's always a good thing to have, good thing to be. Um, then we have minor injuries, motion sickness, pinched nerve, minor shock, aware of the void, pho photophobia. <coughs> All right, these are they look like physical and mental damage. A golden trumpet, fishing net, fuel, 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 satchel of the void, a ticket. Okay, well, didn't find out what these things were, so we gotta go back and find out what that is. I'm just curious. I wanna know what these things are. Ah, well, now the name of it actually makes sense. It's called a formless spawn. Well, it's definitely formless, and it nasty looking so uh, formless spawn vicious and shifting the formless spawn takes on whatever features best serve its master's will alrighty that's that let's see what are some of these other things out here you have a hunting deep one so that's what this is a hunting deep one and it's aquatic, the monster can move through impassable borders that represent water. Okay. And we already saw those guys, those were the shifty ones. Um, where's the others? I guess the other people are just uh, individuals, peoples. Let's see. I know, this is taking so long. Okay. Well, no explanation anywhere. Unfortunate, but these look like people that you can be during in the game. So, oh, there they are! Ha-ha! <laughs> you were probably hoping they're right there. Hopefully you don't see them. All right, so Silas Marsh is this dude right here, it looks like because he doesn't have a shirt on here and he doesn't have a shirt on here but anyway nine health five sanity strength four agility five observation four lower two influence three will three all right and then we have uh trish scarborough and it looks like trish scarborough is this person right here eight and a six four four five two three three that's not bad and then we have Jim Culver, guy with the trumpet. He has six health and eight, eight mental strength, or, or you begin the game with a golden trumpet unique item. Three, three, oh, he's weak. What does the trumpet do then? Huh. Um, Agnes Baker, the waitress. I was right. All right, you begin the game with the storm of spirits spell. What about this, this dude? What? Who is this guy? I don't know who this guy is. 
and I don't see anything out here, so I'm sorry. I don't know what he is. I'm sorry. Oh, wait. Uh, Officer Butlet? Oh, is he a warlock? Yep, he sure is. He's a warlock. This dude's a bad dude. And the warlock says, knowledgeable in both the latest fashions and the oldest spellcraft, warlocks are dangerous result of combining mere mortals with devastating powers. All right, so these guys are warlocks. All right, well, there you have it. That's about it for everything that comes in. Mansions of Madness Horrific Journeys Expansion. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you guys and gals on the flip side. Take care. Thanks for watching. Tune in every day for the Dice Tower's daily game unboxing.